Iron Man turns 75 this year, but he and the new film of his origin have never been better. Man of Steel opens next Friday, stars Henry Cavill in the title role, and Michael Shannon, who plays General Zod, a villain to a degree, exiled from the planet Krypton, ultimately bound for Earth. It'll all make sense in the end. Very, very excited to have you here, Michael, today with us. Thanks, and uh, again, we Sam and I saw yesterday, mind-blowing, so, so good. Uh, for a richly accomplished actor like yourself, however, I read when Zack Snyder, the director, called you up to tell you that you got the part. You were still stunned when he made the call. Yeah, it was kind of a shock. I mean, it was certainly quite a promotion for me. I'd played some sergeants before and a <laughs> lieutenant once, but uh, general is a big jump up. Well, you were genetically engineered to, to, to do it. I like, I want to, Christopher Nolan uh, and Zach were in charge of the story. They really committed to the origin story. We spend a very significant, very important part of time on the planet Krypton. Uh, what do you think that does, especially for the way the movie begins? Well, I think it's really important because I think ultimately Superman is the story of a man torn between two civilizations, mm -hmm. Earth and Krypton. And so the more uh, richly you establish Krypton, the bigger the conflict that Superman endures. And speaking of the conflict, they also made a very interesting choice to show you and Jor-El, played by Russell Crowe, uh, Superman's father, to show that you two actually agreed on a very fundamental point of what was happening to Krypton, and I really thought it imbued your character with a sense of motive and a sense of purpose, and in that way rendered him less a villain, I think, than we might otherwise think. Yeah, exactly. I think with Superman, too, I mean, I love what Terrence Stamp did as much as anybody, but a lot of times you wonder, well, why exactly is he so angry? Why does he want to kill all of us? And, uh, you know, I think with this, it really gives it a, a context. You know, the thing to remember is that they're in a very catastrophic situation on Krypton at the beginning of this movie. There's no time to, to think anymore, so uh, a lot of rash decisions get made. Terrence Stamp, of course, playing General Zod in the first uh, in Superman 2. Uh, the, the preparation for this part, I mean, it is an actioner and then some. Mm -hmm. You are seem to be swinging, punching, hitting, diving in virtually every scene. What was the preparation like physically to prepare for this role? Well, we started months before. Uh, Henry, Russell, Ancha, who plays Feora, and myself uh, started training with uh, Mark Twight, who also did the training on 300. Mm -hmm. So he's very accomplished uh, in that regard. And then uh, with Damon, who is Zack Snyder's uh, stunt guru, uh, he was teaching us all the moves. Uh, they said there's going to be a variety of different kinds of martial arts. And, uh, and we trained for months and months. It's just a fantastic, it was a fantastic movie. I, I think uh, you're a conflicted hero of sorts for the people on Krypton. It might have been a different movie had they made it for the people of Krypton. Michael Shannon, again, it is going to be a huge success. Thank you so much. Thanks, Dad.